Well, tomorrow, San Diego City Council, acting as the city's housing authority, will consider a proposal to turn two familiar hotels into permanent housing for the homeless. KUSI's Ed Linderman has details. We'll get to the two hotels in a moment because the press conference calling attention to Tuesday's council slash housing authority agenda was at the convention center. Since April, some 1,000 homeless have been sheltered here in a program called Shelter to Home, as in a permanent home. And our goal from the very beginning was to reimagine our homeless system to get folks into housing more quickly, with an emphasis on quickly. The San Diego Housing Commission has identified potential homes in what Commission President and CEO Rick Gentry calls a game changer. They are two residence inns owned by Marriott Hotels. One in Mission Valley on Hotel Circle South, the other, a smaller inn, is in Kearney Mesa. The beauty of the purchases, says Gentry, some of it financed by a state program, is that it won't take much to turn mini suites with kitchenettes into permanent homes for some 400 people. Much of the current homeless housing plan involves refurbishing a vacant motel, a far more expensive proposition. But the problem with the plan, according to some of the inn's neighbors, is that it's moving too quickly for a proper review of usual concerns, security, and impact on property values. Gentry says the state requires its money to be spent by the end of the year. However, he says the concerns can be satisfied in the meantime, adding as they've always been. We always do it with the neighborhood in mind. We form a committee to work with the neighborhood and we feel like we're accountable to the neighborhood to make sure that we're good neighbors to them. And that's exactly what we will do this time. We did not reach out to this neighborhood to start with because we're on a tight time frame. We asked Mr. Gentry if he could give us a specific example. The Hotel Churchill downtown is a stellar example. Now the difference with the Churchill is that it took us a long time to get that property which was in derelict status habitable. And I think if you look at that property, both the way it looks, the way it operates, its uh, proximity to other uh, multifamily living, and the way that uh, it fits into the neighborhood, it works just fine. Downtown Ed Lenderman, KUSI News.